recording right now. Um, so we've got a five minute warm up, just a five minute warm up. Um, and it's not because I didn't listen to you guys when you said you like a longer warm up, Steve. I'm talking to you. I do listen to you and I do try to do that once in a while. But for some time, sometimes as we move into the first stage, we don't necessarily need a longer warm up because the first stage ends up being a continuation of the warm up. So that's that's kind of what we're going to be doing today. So 70 to 80 RPMs with your warm up gear on. Good morning, Susan. Great to see you today. And she's down at the beach today, right? Yes. Oh, now, wait a minute. You've got a sweatshirt on. I'm really jealous about that. <laughs> I have, I air conditioned the room and I have a fan pointing straight at me. Oh, good. Good for you. It's like good. too cold. Oh my gosh. I would love to say that it's too cold. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I played pickleball this morning and just, I'm not kidding you, just drip, just dripping, absolutely dripping. I had to get in the shower as soon as I got home, so... Anyway, okay, so 70 to 80, you choose where you want to be. So, Deborah, if you're just coming back, you may want to hang closer to 70, and that's great. Mm -hmm. You want to keep light resistance on to set up that pedal stroke for success. Pamela, how are you feeling today? Feeling good. Good. I'm glad to hear that. Great. Great, have, great, great. I have my watch, so I have my, I have my, uh, my, my. Good. That's important, and we're going we're gonna to keep it below 125, correct? Below 125. Yeah. Okay, that sounds absolutely great. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Norma, I didn't officially welcome you. How are you? I'm great. How are oh, you? Good, I'm great. I'm great too. So good to see everybody. Wonderful, great group. And Carolina, you doing okay? I'm doing good, thanks. Good, glad to hear that. Wonderful. Okay, so just set it up nice and easy. If you haven't had any hydration, this is the time to do it. Um, because it takes a while for that hydration to hit bottom, you know, so we want to be hydrated as we start lifting up that heart rate. So that's what we'll be doing um, kind of for the next three minutes, just kind of warming it up. So let's see, we've got one, two, three, four. Um, I'm going to say definitely three stages today. Um, could be four, depending on how quickly we go through the, um, the uh, recoveries. And we'll try to make it as challenging as you would like it today, okay, as, as you would like it. Catherine, so are you still up north too? Yes, I'm still in Virginia. You're still in Virginia, okay. Okay, you've had triple digit numbers there for, yes, yeah, it's, it's been very warm there. Yeah, my daughter's there, so I do follow that, yeah. Alrighty, so we got a little over two minutes. So if you're ready to begin coming up towards 80, let's go ahead and do that with only warm up gear. Nice smooth rotation of the pedal stroke, set up the, your upper body up for success, shoulders down, chest is up. We wanna have light grip only on the handlebars, only on the handlebars. Susie, I'm wondering what kind of bike you have. Do you have a Peloton? Yeah, cool beans. Good, good, good. So are you starting at 25 for your for your warm up? Twenty thirty-five? Thirty-five. Wow. Oh my gosh, Susie. Wait, I gotta put that in red. <laughs> Great. Great, great. All right, kiddos, right here, right here, right here. We're getting ready to move right into the first stage. So <laughs> what I want you to do is I want you to just pull it back, sit it up, posture break it back. Let's move right into the first stage. Hydrate, hydrate. Come on back to your handlebars. We're going to take one minute at 80 RPMs. So when you're at one minute at 80, you're staying with the warm-up gear. One minute at 80, stay with the warm-up gear, 80 RPM. So those of you who have been hanging lower, this is going to be enough intensity for one minute, right? So just hold 80 RPMs. So as we move from 80, it'll be we're going to be accelerating for 15 seconds and pulling it back for 15 seconds. But we need to stay here. We need to kind of get that mind to body connection at 80 RPMs. Great. Everyone's keeping an eye on their heart rates. 
as we accelerate, heart rate will come up slightly and we'll, we'll just kind of plateau it back at 80. The first stage is six and a half minutes long. So we can say five minutes for the warm up, six and a half minutes for the first stage, 11 and a half, half minutes to get yourself really ready to go. All right, here we go, guys. We're gonna, we're gonna accelerate. You're gonna do the best job you can to accelerate. The highest acceleration will be 90. Let's go ahead and begin now. So just 15 seconds with acceleration. So it can go 80 to 90. It can go 80 to 81. It can go 80 to 85. It's up to you for four, three, two, and pull it back to 80. Okay, great job. Great job, great job, great job. We're doing that two more times, just like that. Acceleration and pull back, but only for 15 seconds. Great job. I love this ride. I love this ride. Go ahead, accelerate again. Your highest number is 90 RPMs. Your lowest number is 81 RPMs, okay? Just as long as you accelerate a tad, doesn't make any difference. Three, that's a medical term. Two, one, pull it back, 80 RPMs. A tad is medical. Okay, all right, okay. All right, so now you're back to 80. One more time, we're gonna accelerate in three, two, we're gonna do it again. Accelerate, please, for 15 seconds. Great job, excellent job, excellent job. All righty, nice work, nice work, nice work. You've got five seconds, four, three, two, and one. Pull it back, 80, hold 15 seconds. Now, if you were, if you were able to get, if you were able to get up towards 90 RPMs, you're gonna be adding a gear beginning now. Okay, you've got one minute, one minute at 80 RPMs, one minute at 80 RPMs. So you've either got base gear or base gear plus one, great. The only time you would add a, a gear is if you've been able to accelerate with no challenge as far as trying to get to those RPMs. So now you're cruising it out, cruising it out for 38 more seconds at 80. So the first time we accelerated was 15 seconds, three times. This next one will be 20 second acceleration, either with base gear or base gear plus one. We have 20 seconds to repair, shoulders down, chest is up. All right, great, light hand grip, light hand grip. Wonderful job, keep it here, keep it here. 10 seconds to go. All righty, we're getting ready. This is a 20 second acceleration, a 20 second pull back to 80. Begin now, great job. 20 seconds, 20 seconds, 20 seconds towards 90 RPMs. Do the best job you can to accelerate. Once again, if it's just 81 or 82 or 83, that's good, that's good. Don't worry about it. All right, good, we've got five more seconds to complete this first acceleration. Now, 80 RPMs, pull it back. Good job, good job, good job, good job. Excellent work, excellent work. Okay, you're halfway through the pullback to 80, halfway through the pullback to 80. Don't worry about your heart rate, let your heart rate respond, okay? Here we go again, we're going back up towards 90. Best job you can. 20 seconds to accelerate, you're five in. Good job, good job, good job, good job. You're 10 in, good job, good job, good job. Excellent job. You have five to go, four to go, three, two, 80 RPMs, pull it back. Nice job, nice job, nice job, great job. All right, one more, one more. How's everybody holding up, okay? Good, okay, I didn't even hear anything, but I'm saying okay, all right, good. Okay, five seconds to go, get ready, here we go again. Last acceleration begins now. Accelerate up towards 90, no higher than 90. Hold it here, hold it here, great job, great job. You are halfway through it, halfway through it. Good job, you've got five seconds to go. Four, three, Two, 80 RPMs, pull it back. Okay, everybody, we've got one minute at 80. Stay here for one minute. Great job. 
Stay here for one minute. Great job. Excellent. So take a look at your heart rate right now. Yeah? Okay. Now, when we get heart rates after this minute, I want two heart rates to report. Okay? One at the highest level and one after a minute back to 80. So 38 seconds to go. Good work. 35 seconds to go at 80. You're going to get recovery. Good job. You are just 11 minutes into class, which means you're still in oxygen deprivation. All right, 22 seconds to go at 80. Good job. So this, this fast accelerations and pullback, we don't have time to really, really, you know, enjoy that pullback because we're always going to be on the edge of working hard. Four, three, Two, grab your other heart rate and recover. 70 RPMs, take your resistance off. Good job. Susan, your heart rate? Um, 126 and for some reason it stopped. That was That's the okay. first time. Oh, okay, no worries, no worries. Catherine? 105. Okay, is that what it was on the highest number two at 90? Yes. Okay. I need to so Okay, that's all right. Steve, how about you, honey? 92. Okay, Maura? 117, 105. And it dropped to 105 right after that. Wonderful job, kiddo. Great job. Deborah? Uh, 120. Ooh, yeah. In gear six. Good. Um, Good. Now it doesn't, I'm not sure exactly where it is. No, and it's all, it's great. That's great. Don't come out of gear six on this class, okay? Stay mm -hmm. right there. Great. Lori. Um, 120. Mm -hmm. And 105. 105. Good job. Good job. Good job. Andy. 127 and 124. <laughs> I love you, Andy. Thanks. Carolina. 94 and 93. Um, 91. Good job. Barry. 94 and 94. Good. Okay. Great. Stacy. 118. And then it went down a little bit and then jumped back up to 120. Okay. Where is it right now, Stacy? Uh, 96. <laughs> Good job. Susie, one. Yeah. It's one. Yeah. One. Yeah. Two. One, two. One, two, three. One, two, three. Yay. Good job. Excellent job. Pamela. Hi, I, I, I've been up and down a couple times. So. That's okay. We'll catch on the next one. Norma. 93 and 89. 89 Good job. 93. Good job. Excellent. Felina. 82. Okay, great, honey. Mike. Wow, great, perfect. And Phil? Uh, 116 and 150. Wonderful job. Everybody did great. Thank you for that. Okay, we're going back to the same resistance we had on the last effort. We're going to go back to one minute at 80. So let's begin now. One minute at 80 RPMs. Good job. Same resistance you had on your last effort. Okay, whatever you had there, put it back on. Maura, that's really good. 117 and drop back to 105. Wow, that's crazy good. Good job. Good job on that. Okay, so we have one minute at 80 RPM. Same resistance that we left the first stage with. Okay, everyone did really great. Polina, what was the fastest RPM you achieved on that last effort? I started with 88. Fantastic job, Polina. Great job. 25 Good. seconds to go at 80 RPM. So we're coming back into it. But this time we're only gonna lift the RPM to 85 as we accelerate. Now that will change towards the end, but we're gonna only work at 85 RPM. So don't worry, don't worry. Nothing bad's gonna happen here, okay? You're gonna just still continue to saturate oxygen. Okay, don't so. About the thing. <laughs> don't worry about the thing, Steve, that's right. Okay, so here we go, guys. 85 RPMs for 30 seconds. Now, if you're able to do one minute at 80 with the same resistance you had on your last effort, and you're able to accelerate to 85 and hold for 30 seconds, when we come back to 80, I'm gonna ask you to add another gear, all right? I'm gonna ask you to add another gear. 
Okay, eight seconds to go. Now I told you not to worry because you know you can always take that gear away, right? Okay, three, two, out of gear if you're able and you're coming back to 80 for one minute. Good. So 80 kind of is like, is like our home base. It's kind of like our home base on this class. We'll accelerate out of, you know, out of that home base. We'll take a little bit of a, you know, a little bit of a hike and then we'll always come back home. You're in charge of the resistance. So if you feel like you're working too hard according to your heart rate, always feel free to come back with that resistance to drop it down one, even a half if you want, even a half. Susie, you're learning how to do this on that Peloton. Yeah, exactly. Because you can dial in that Peloton just right or left, very, very, you know, just a little bit here, a little bit there, and boom, you got it. All right, so 18 seconds to go. We're going to go back to that 85 RPMs and we're going to hold it for 30 seconds. Wait, wait for it. Wait for it. Okay, get ready. Three, two, and one. Let's go now. 85 RPMs for 30 seconds. Great job. Great job, great job, great job. Excellent job. All right, so now if you've added another gear on, even though we're still at 85, you may not see the same output you did at 90 with one less gear. Maybe, maybe not. Are you aware of that? Are you kind of following that? That's going to be up to you if you want to do that. I didn't ask you to do that, but start, you know, kind of seeing what I'm talking about. All right, good. Come on back. 80 RPMs again. 80 RPMs. Hold here, please. One minute. One minute at 80. Okay, great. Barry, where's your heart rate? Uh, 93. That's perfect. That's perfect. Maura, where's your heart rate real quick? Measuring uh, 107. Okay. Oh, wow. Good. That's excellent. That's excellent. Susie, <laughs> one, two, 120. Perfect. Perfect. So hold here, guys. 35 more seconds. We're at 80. We're going to go back to 85. And you know what's going to happen. We're going to start increasing the RPM. All right. So if you've got output, Deborah, you got wattage, right? But you're gonna mm -hmm. stay with with you're just gonna stay with gear six. You're not gonna add intensity quite yet. All right, so 13 seconds to go. Great. All you're worried about, Deborah, is getting to the RPMs. That's all you want to do. Eight seconds to go. Here we go again. We're gonna go back up to 85, and I want you to see your output or wattage. Let's go now. All right, good. Good, 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 good. So I didn't mention that this was a little bit longer stage, right? This is a 10 minute stage. So we're using that oxygen that we have available and we're just gonna push that envelope just a little bit. Good, good. All right, you're at 85 RPMs, is that correct? Look at your output, look at your output. I want you to see what your output or your wattage is. Five seconds to go, good. Three, two, now pull it back. 80 RPMs. Okay, we've got one minute at 80 RPMs. Hold here. What's your output here? Lori, tell me the two outputs. 78 and 84. 84. Okay, so you're at 78 right now. Yes. Okay, great. Okay. Everybody should kind of see that a little bit of that difference, right? Susie, you see the difference between the 85 output and the 80. Okay, great. All righty. Now, I told you that it was gonna get a little bit more intense and we're gonna be adding RPM. So instead of going back to the 85 RPMs, we're gonna give it 30 seconds at 90. Get ready because that will be more intense. So you're gonna see a bigger output, right? So Lori, you're gonna kind of get hanging into the 90s, I would imagine, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, okay, good. Okay, in 10 seconds. In 10 seconds, I'm going to ask you to go ahead and go to 90, but it's only for 30 seconds. All right, let's go now. Okay, 90 RPMs for 30 seconds. Okay, now we've got bigger output, right, Stacy? Yep. What's your output? It's 80. 80, great. That is really good for you. That is really, really good for you. Barry, where's your output? Not that good. It's about 50. That's okay, no worries, no worries. Okay, eight seconds to go. All right, everybody, output wattage power, see what you got. 
We're gonna pull it back to 80 one more time, beginning now. Okay, so one minute at 80, one minute at 80. So you should have seen a dramatic drop in the power, is that correct, or output, right? Okay, great. Phil, what's your what's your output right here? Right. <clears throat> at 80 is 64, at 90 is 80. Okay, that's perfect. Andy, what about you? Where's your output right now? 56. And 56. Okay, and great. At 90 is 68. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. So in my opinion, in my humble opinion, now we're 21 minutes into class, right? So you're saturated with oxygen. You've already written for 30 seconds with a higher output, a higher wattage, right? Okay, so what we wanna do is we're gonna revisit that. So I want you to go back to the highest output that you were using. When we go to 85, I want you to dial in the resistance until you match the 90 RPM output. Whoop. Yes, okay, let's do it. Go to 85 RPMs, 85, dial in your resistance until you see your 90 RPM output. All right, got 30 seconds. Great. Now it's no longer fun, right? Now it's work. Now it's work. But you're 22 minutes in the class. So that means you're getting, you're really saturated with oxygen. So you may feel like you're working, but you're ready to work. You're ready to work. All right, stay right here, guys. You've got eight seconds at 85. Don't touch your resistance. Don't touch your resistance. Slow it down, 80 RPMs, one minute. Good job, good job, good job. You've got one minute at 80 RPMs. Okay, Lori, your heart rate? 125. Perfect, Susan, your heart rate? 136. 136, ooh, up there, okay. Maura, your heart rate? 115. 115, that's good, that's good. Catherine, your heart rate? 109. Good job, honey, Steve, your heart rate? 107. 107. Okay. Deborah, your heart rate? 121. 121. Good job, Deborah. Andy, your heart rate? 133. <laughs> okay, kiddo. Pamela, your heart rate? Uh, 119. 119. Great. That's perfect. Susie, one, two. One, two, six. Perfect. Oh, I love it. Don't you? You got to come back to the gym more often. <laughs> you got to come back to the gym more often. Okay, 10 seconds to go. All right, here we go, guys. You're almost done with this stage. 85 RPMs, go ahead, lift the RPM up to 85. You're gonna hold for 30 seconds. Come on, we're getting closer and closer and closer to the end of the stage. And we're gonna get three minutes to recover. Okay, three minutes to recover. You are now 23 minutes into class. Great job. Great job. Phil, what's your heart rate? 122. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Carolina, what's your heart rate? 96. Excellent job. Get ready. Shoulders down, chest up. We are now moving into hard territory. 30 seconds at 90. Push it to 90 RPMs. Heart rates are going to come up. Good job, Pamela. Your heart rate? 121. 121. Okay, let's be careful with that. Okay, Norma, your heart rate? 96. That's great. That's great. Mike, your heart rate? 108. 108. Beautiful job. You've got eight seconds to go. You've got five seconds to go. You're at 90. Remember your output. Remember your output. Three, two, heart rate and recover. You've got three minutes to recover at 70 RPMs, take your resistance off. Okay, so that got a little more challenging, didn't it? Yeah. Right? That got challenging at the right. end. Yeah. Yep. But you guys were ready for that. You were ready to get off that little plateau and you were ready to push it. Now it's time to bring that heart rate back down again. Great, 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 great. All right, Polina, what was your heart rate? 133. Wow, whoa, whoa, girl. You okay? Yeah, it came up to one sort actually. Oh, wow. It's a great day. It's a great day in Canada. Yeah, it is. Thank you. It is. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome. Oh, gosh. Andy, at the very end, what was it? 34. Excellent. Stacy, at the very end. 
122. Excellent work, honey. At the very end, Deborah, what was yours? Uh, 120, 121. I think that's that 40, 40 watts. And, and that, is, that is great. That is great for today. Good job. Excellent job. Maura, at the very end, what was your heart rate? 118. 118. Ooh, baby girl. You okay? 104 now. Oh, honey, you are in such great shape. Good job, Maura. Good job. Susan, at the very end? 133. Oh, honey, you okay? Yeah, I'm going to switch my shoes. <laughs> okay, kiddo. Okay. okay, no worries. Catherine, at the very end, did it change? 110. 110. Oh, yeah, it did change. Well done. Steve, how about you? Did it change? 112. Okay, kiddo. Where's your resistance? 30, uh, 31. I can't ask you to do much more than that. Okay, good job. Good job, Lori. 129. 129. That was fantastic. Any change, Carolina, at the very end? 98. Oh, excellent work. Barry, at the very end, any change? 97. 97. Good job. Good job. Phil, did you have any change? Uh, 125 yeah. and 33. 125 at 33, brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Susan, any higher than the last one you quoted me? A little bit higher? Oh, 114, right. So Susie, how about you? One, two, same thing, 120, 126, great. <laughs> How's that perceived exertion, Susie? It's high, isn't it? Is your perceived exertion high, Susie? Is it going up? Is about an eight out of 10? What's what's perceived to be how you're feeling? How you're feeling? You're working oh, hard. Okay. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I wonder if something's not right with the Peloton because I go up to 38, 39 resistance. It may be set differently, most definitely. I, I yeah. Can't, yeah. Let's go ahead and just that's okay, Susie. Just go ahead. We'll just go ahead and use your heart rate as our guide, okay? That's great. Okay, kiddos, let's go. We're going back. We're going back. Okay. So I want you to start at 80 RPMs again. Highest resistance you had on your last effort. Okay, now, this is weird. This is 10 minutes, 40 seconds. 10 minutes, 40 seconds. What? Yeah, 10 minutes, 40 seconds. And Pamela will recover, and then we'll kind of flush it out <laughs> at the end, okay? All right, so 10 minutes, 40 seconds. We're going to get started beginning now. 80 RPMs, highest resistance you had on your last effort. Good. Okay, so we're gonna just kind of kind of bring ourselves back to the ride. Okay, Big, back to the ride. Good pedal strokes, good. So you're back at it, highest resistance, but you're not at the highest output, correct? Right, okay, right, right. okay, great. So if you didn't want to do anything anymore, you wouldn't have to. You just stay here. Okay, you just stay here. You've already done a great job. You've already done a great job. Remember that, okay? Pamela, you got that? Okay, you've already done a great job. All right. Now what I'm going to ask you to do, now don't be mad at me. You're going to add one more turn of resistance, but you're going to stay at 80. Okay. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to check in with your output, your wattage, your power. Uh huh. Now, are, Lori, are you even close to your highest output or are you hanging below or are you above? 82. Yeah. Yeah. We all know you can work at 82 output, right? Right. <laughs> right. Right. Yeah, exactly. And Deborah, what's your wattage here? Um... I, I sit down for you a little bit. What it is, um, 35. Great. That's perfect. We want you under that 40, 40, 45. Stacey, what's your output right here? 75. Great. We all know you can work at 75. We all know that. Right, Stacy. Yeah, it's harder, though. It is harder. <laughs> I know. It. It's harder. Okay, now what I'm going to have you do is I'm going to have you drop that resistance and go to 85. Drop that resistance that you just added on. Now go to 85. Check with your output or power here, Stacy. Where are you now? 78. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh my gosh. Okay, Susie, don't let that person intimidate you. Okay. <laughs> don't let them intimidate you. Okay. They were yelling at her because she had her phone. All right. Okay, Lori. Now what's the difference between the resistance at 80 output and now let, letting go of that resistance and output now? What's the difference? 76. Yeah. So you can ride here a long time, couldn't you? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Andy, how about you? What's your output at 85? Five. What is it? 65. Oh, yeah. I'm not worried about you. All right. Kick it to 90. 30 seconds. Kick it to 90 for 30 seconds. Oh, boy. Now, Stacy, what's your output? 87. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Phil, what's your output? 87. All right, cool beans. Barry, where's your output? Up to 55. Wonderful job, wonderful job, wonderful job. Eight seconds, eight seconds, eight, five seconds, four, three, two, 80 RPMs, pull it back. Good job, good job, good job, good job. Woo, Norma, how you feeling? What's your heart rate? Are you Norma? speaking? Oh, I'm yes. sorry. That's what yeah. It went away. <laughs> oh, okay. It went away. That darn heart rate. It's elusive today. Uh, no worries. Steve, where's your heart rate? 107. 107. What's going on with you today? Um, I'm sort of taking it easy. That's okay. Are you traveling soon? No, I had an infected toe. Oh my gosh, Steve, you should have told me that. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. That's it's horrible. It's getting better. It's getting better, good. Yeah. Oh yeah, take it easy, please. Maura, what's your heart rate here? Maura? Oh, she froze. All right, here we go now, back up. 85 okay, arm. Oh, I'm sorry, sweetie, say it. Um, it was 106, it's measuring still. Okay. That's 107. okay. 107. Great. 85 RPMs. We're lifting 85 RPMs. Hold. Okay, Lori, now your heart rate. 120. 120. Excellent job. Carolina, your heart rate. 97. Good. And Catherine, your heart rate. Uh, 110. Good. Good, good, good. Pamela, you taking a break? Yeah. Um, my heart rate went to like 127 without me noticing it. Okay, so you just, okay, slow down, great. But you're pedaling lightly, is that correct? Yeah. Okay, very good, very good, very good. Deborah, what's your heart rate? I see you looking. 119. 119, that's excellent. Susan, what's your heart rate here, honey? Right now it's 128. 128, okay, you might want to stay there, Susan, because the rest of us are going to 90. Let's go now, 90, 30 seconds. 90 RPMs for 30 seconds. This is a long stage, isn't it? This is a long stage. Now. If you didn't want to go to 90, you don't have to go to 90, okay? I'm not the boss of you. If that's too hard for you to go to 90 and hold it for 30 seconds, don't do it. Just hang closer to 80 and just ride it out. You're doing a great job. Great. Okay, eight seconds to go. You're at 90. Great. Great, great. Five seconds to go. Four, three, two, 80 RPMs. Pull it back. You have four minutes, 40 seconds to complete this stage. Four minutes, 40 seconds to complete this stage. You guys are doing a fantastic job. So the first stage started at six and a half minutes. Second stage was 10 minutes. This is 10 minutes, 40 seconds. So the, the stages get longer. They get a little bit more intense, kind of buried in it. You don't have to do it if intensity is too challenging for you today. All right, Lori, right here, where's your output? Uh, 75. 75, where's your heart rate? 124. That's perfect. Lori, that couldn't be better. That couldn't be better. Great job, 20 seconds to go. Great, we're gonna go up the ladder of success one more time, okay? We've got three minutes, 40 seconds to complete the stage. If you don't wanna accelerate with us, you do not have to. Eight seconds to go. Deborah. that's up to you, okay? How you wanna handle it. Three, two, you're back to 85 RPMs. All right, now in 30 seconds, I'm gonna ask you to check in with your heart rates. If you're able to stay at 85 RPMs for another 30 seconds, I want you to do it. 
But if 30 seconds at 85 is where you want to go, and that's as far as you want to go, I want you to drop back to 80 for the second part of that minute, okay? All right, good. Five seconds to go. You're going to check in. Now, make a decision. Stay at 85 or go back to 80. It's your decision. It's your decision. But no acceleration yet. Just either stay at 85 or go back to 80. It's up to you. Choose one of those opportunities. Great. All right. Now, you got to be careful because as we fatigue, your form is going to break down. So we got to focus on form. Now, if you're at 80, you're going to go to 85. Now, if you're at 85, you're going to go to 90. 30 seconds. Good job. Good job. Everybody can be successful here, whether you're at 80, whether you're at 85, or whether you're at 90. You're making it work for you. Good. 15 seconds to go. I'm going to have everybody check in with their heart rate in 10 seconds. We're going to pull back to 80, and we're going to all hold 80 RPMs in 5, 4, 3, 2. You're at 80 RPMs. Pull it back. Now hold. Okay, great. Check in with your heart rates. Andy? 138. Good job. Oh, kiddo. Nice work. Lori? 128. 128. Excellent. Deborah? 125. Good job. Steve? 115. Good. Catherine? 106. 106. Good job, Susan. It was 128 at 90. Okay, great. And Maura, what's your heart rate? 114. Good job. Carolina? 101. 101. Great. Oh, good job, Carolina. Barry, how about you? 101. 101. Stacy, what about you? Your heart rate at the highest one? 124. Okay, great. Here we go. 14 seconds to go. Susie, one, two, what? One, two, six, one, three. Oh, she's showing off. Good job, kiddo. Good job. All righty. Now what I'm going to have you do, back up to 85, 30 seconds. Good job. Back up to 85. Feel your heart rate. 131. All right, honey, be careful. You haven't been in the 130s for a while. Be careful. Be careful, 15 seconds to go. Good job, you're at 85 RPMs, is that correct? Yes. All right, you've got five seconds, make a decision. Can you come to 90? Can you come to 90? Beginning now, you've got 40 seconds to complete this stage. Awesome work. Can you go to 90 for 40 seconds? Heart rates are gonna lift, be mindful. Maybe you don't want it to go any higher. Maybe you don't want it to go any higher. Stay down there at 85 or drop it back to 80. Up to you guys. Up to you. Good job, good job, good job. You are 20 seconds in. You have 20 more seconds to ride this stage. You're going to get recovery. And the hardest part of the class is going to be over. 10 seconds to go. You're almost there. Really good job. Eight seconds to go, you're almost there. Wherever you're at with the RPM, you are successful. Three, two, grab that heart rate and recover. Come all the way back to 70 RPMs and please take your resistance off. Woo, well done. I don't know about you guys, but I am exhausted. All right, good job, everybody. Helena, how about you? What was your heart rate, love? One, two, three, four. No kidding. Are you okay? Yeah. So okay. Far, yeah. Oh, so far, so good. Keep pedaling lightly there, please. Pamela, did your heart rate come back? Yeah, I was I was um 122 and I rebounded to 124. Okay. All right, good. All right, kiddo. Glad you're back. Andy, how about you? 40. 140. Oh my gosh. What was your highest output there? 74. Way to go, Andy. Way to go. Lori, how about you? What are we doing? Heart rate. 129. 120, that's what I needed. What was your highest output? Curious. 111. <laughs> I love those numbers, Lori. Good job. Excellent. Deborah, highest heart rate? 123. Well done today, Deborah. Well done. Steve, how about you, sweetheart? Um, 120. Good job. Excellent job. Is it your big toe? Yeah. I hate that. Is it turf toe? Is it what? Turf toe? T-U-R-F toe? 
Like football players get when you play football? No. Um, they, they need to do some recontouring of the nail. Ouch. That doesn't feel pleasant. That doesn't sound pleasant, kiddo. But I am better. Okay. Good, honey. I'm glad. I'm glad, glad I'm here today. I'm glad you're here today too. Oh, Susie, thanks for sending that. That's great. Catherine, what was your highest heart rate there? 110. 110, really good. Maura, how about you? 120. 120? Yeah. Tell me about that. How'd you feel? I felt fine. You didn't great. feel like your hair was on fire? No? <laughs> no. Okay. And I'm 96 now. Wow. Wow. Lovely job. Susan, how about you, honey? What was your highest heart rate? 126. 126. Wow. Good job. Norma, your highest heart rate? 94. 94. Excellent work. Phil, your heart rate? 131. Brilliant. Mike, your highest heart rate? 111. 111. Okay. <laughs> What gives? I don't know, Susie. I know. I know. It could be the bike, the difference in the bike. I know. I know. I like this, though, don't you? I like these numbers, don't you? <laughs> All righty, kiddos. We're going. You're done now. You're basically done. Just go back to base gear plus one. That's all you got left. Base gear plus one. Everybody can handle this. We are doing two and a half minutes in at starting out at 80. Base gear plus one, ride it out, feel delicious. See what happens to the heart rate in two and a half minutes. I mean, come on. We've already stressed the heart rate. The heart is going, it's just fantastic. It feels fantastic. Blowing out anything, it just feels great. Oxygen uptake, fantastic. I mean, oh my gosh. I feel, I bet you guys feel like you can go out and run a marathon after this, right? No, I know not. <laughs> I know not. Okay, good. 55 seconds to go at 80, and then we'll start lifting to 85 and 90 and finishing it up. Great job, Deborah. Great to have you back in class today. So glad you're here. 15 mm -hmm. seconds. Yeah, you're doing great. You're doing great. 40 more seconds. We're staying at 80, just kind of cruising it out now. Hard work is over. Hard work is over. We're just riding it out to the very end. That's all we're doing. Staying within those parameters of 80 to 90 with lesser resistance on board. Great work. All right, 23 seconds to go. Carolina, you feeling pretty good? Yeah. yeah good. I'm, I'm really glad to hear that. Okay, so now we have a little over a minute to complete this ride. So what we're going to be doing is lifting that, lifting that RPM up five. So let's lift it up five. We're going to go to 85 RPMs. 85, this feels like, oh my gosh, this feels like the ride home, right? Yeah, that's exactly what it is, the ride home. Great work, guys. 24 seconds to ride at 85. We'll finish topping that out at 90, and then we'll have total recovery coming up. Good job. This is a great class to have towards the beginning of next week. So next Tuesday, probably this is the one I'll encourage you to ride. Thursday will be something similar. Saturday will be a lesser intense ride, just like we did on a Saturday. Okay, 90 RPMs, picking it up. Good job, good job, good job. I like to do it. I like to peak you guys out at Tuesday with intensity, same kind of intensity, slightly lower on Thursday, and then Saturday, you know, just benefiting from all of your cardiovascular activity. I love doing that for you guys. Eight seconds to go. Five seconds to go, four, three, two, and one. Go ahead, bring it all the way back, slow it down, take your resistance off. Don't worry about staying at 70 RPMs. You guys did a fantastic job. Congratulations. Well done, well done, well done. Susie, with those numbers, oh my gosh, kiddo, wow. How are you feeling? Are you feeling... You're okay. Good. Yeah. Don't, don't talk on your phone or anything because we don't want you yelled at again. Okay. Some people are just mean. They're just mean. Okay. So did anyone achieve a higher heart rate than they quoted me on the last effort? Susan, you did. What was your heart rate, honey? 131. 131. 
That's okay. No uh, worries yes. there. So I received a text message just a couple of minutes ago on my phone, and this had to do with the. We don't want. <laughs> we don't have to listen to Mary. <laughs> All right. Anybody else, Pamela? Are you okay with your heart rate? Yes. Okay. And Maura, are you okay with your heart rate? Yes. Maura, you okay with your heart rate? Yes. Yeah. Good. And Deborah, you're okay with your heart rate too? The highest. Okay. Yeah, great. Um, Wonderful. Great job, Maura. Great job. And Norma, your heart rate's okay? Yes. Good. All right. We're going to stretch out, come upper body, and then we'll stretch lower body. So shake it out, drop the hands down to our side, roll the shoulders up, back, and down. Take a big inhale. Let's reach it all the way up. And exhaling all the way down, lacing our fingers behind us, walking our shoulders back, really opening up through the chest. So you're suspicious of those numbers, hey, Susie? <laughs> Sweep it forward, lace the fingers together, hands press away, chin lowers to chest. Um, yeah, I guess I understand how you're feeling, but those numbers reflect, in my opinion, how hard you look like you're working. Does that make sense? Yeah, okay, shoulder roll. Left arm across the chest, bringing it down, shoulders down, chest is up. But bikes are different. They give out different outputs, different you know, wattages, different power um, with resistance. Hard to kind of compare apples to apples when you're on a different bike, right? Yeah, okay. All right, come all the way down with the arm, roll the shoulder up, back and down. We're gonna bring that right arm across the chest. So just reminding you guys, I will see you next week, uh, July 1st through July 8th. I won't be uh, with you on a live class, but I'll be sending you the recordings of the three classes that I would like for you to do if you feel that you can. And don't worry about it if you wanna take a break, it's okay. It's okay. All the way down and shoulder roll up, back, and down. Great. Okay. Here comes eagle arms, Andy. Here we go, buddy. Open. Okay. Hug the most important person in your life. Drop the right elbow into the crook of the left. Squeeze those elbows together as we lift those elbows up to feel that delicious stretch. Great job. Lower those elbows down. Release out those arms and shoulder roll up, back, and down. Good. Here we go, open again. Okay, hug that person again, drop the right left elbow into the crook of the right, squeeze and lift. Good job. Good, good, good. Lower down, release, and shoulder roll up, back and down. Make sure all those heart rates are down so when you take your big inhale reaching up and your exhale reaching all the way out to those end handlebars, we wanna make sure that we are keeping our feet parallel to the floor. The heart rates are down enough to peel ourselves up off the saddle. Great job today. Couldn't have been a better job for anybody. Everyone did a great job. So feet are fly, heels are dropping, front knee soft, tail comes back. Go ahead, lift the chest up, rotate those pedals, do the same thing on the other side. Great job, guys. Great job. Good. Good. How's everybody feeling so far? Somebody, everybody okay? Yeah. Okay. Mike, great job for you today. Great job. Okay, so when you're ready, come all the way up, float to your saddle, and then when you're ready to step off the bike, let's do that together. Make sure you're holding on to your frame. Deborah, we would all love to know some of the interesting exercises or stretches that you possibly found that were beneficial to you, or was it just time that took care of it? I, I, I think both. Mm -hmm. And also, you know, pain, pe pain pills. <laughs> oh, yeah, to try and get rid of that inflammation, right? Yeah. Okay, giant step forward with the right foot, giant step back with the left, drop the left heel down towards the floor, begin to feel that stretch up through the calf. Good, and Nick Kelly's tendon, good job. Excellent job. Doesn't that feel fantastic? Good, now lift up that left heel, come into a lunge and tuck underneath that left hip and press that left hip forward to stretch through the hip flexor on the left side. Good job. Excellent job. Go ahead and untuck that left hip, step together, right foot steps back. Let's drop the right heel down. 
Good, soften the left knee. We want to get into the calf stretch on the right side now. Feel that nice, delicious stretch through the calf and the Achilles tendon. Ooh, Steve, is this hard for you? Lift up the right heel, come into a lunge, tuck underneath that right hip, stretch through the lengthen, stretch through the right hip flexor. Tighten up that right glute if you would like, just to intensify that stretch. Go ahead and untuck that right hip and step together. Great job. Make sure you're kicking out any, any kind of intensity there. Step forward with the left foot, flex your left foot, step back onto the right supporting heel, bend the right knee, hinge forward. Yes, try not to drop the head below the heart, drive that left heel into the floor, feel the hamstring stretch, maybe even in the calf, depending on how much intensity you felt. Come all the way up, lift up the left knee, cross over that left ankle, over the right, and go ahead and sit down your back, back into that right heel. Good, do the best job you can to open up this left hip without pressing down through the left knee. Okay, from here, we're gonna rise up and we're gonna lift the left knee up, reach down and back for the left foot, knee down, hip down, quadriceps stretch. Doesn't that feel great? Remember to change a little bit of intensity. You can bring this right knee, left knee back just slightly without arching the back, bringing that stretch up to the mid thigh. What? Go ahead, release that foot and step yeah. down. Ring or the ground? Great job. Oh, no. uh, ring. Shift oh. the weight to the oh. left foot, step forward. Move Everybody's the right. Oh, no. the right, the right foot, drive that front heel in. So right hamstring stretch here. That feels really good, especially if you're right side dominant. Come all the way up, lift the right knee up, cross over and down and back. But just uh, outer hip stretch right here, outer hip. Good work. Now slowly rise, lift the right knee up, reach back for that right foot, knee down, hip down, lengthen out. So make sure if you want to keep those knees side to side, do it here. If you want to bring that right knee back slightly without arching the back, you want to go ahead and feel the intensity come up, the stretch come up to the mid thigh. Go ahead, release that and step down. Great. Kick out. Okay, IT band is next. We're gonna take the left behind the right ankle. Okay, your left foot is in the back, so you might wanna reach up with your left arm and hinge, or hinge forward and just bring those left fingers down to the middle of the front of that right shin. Really squeeze those inner thighs together so we can get at that IT band. Go ahead and drag the fingers up. I'm cross, kick out, good. Other side, left behind right. Whoops, I'm sorry, right behind left. <laughs> right arm comes up if you would like and lean to the left or hinge forward. Good, either one is fine, whatever works better for you. IT band stretch on the side of the right leg. Slowly come up, rise up, uncross and kick out. Good job. Last stretch, standing cat. Your kick lifts, hinge forward. Slide the hands down to cup the kneecaps with the thumbs, slide the shoulders down and back. Chin tucks towards chest, draw the belly in as we bring the tail in. Good, and lift the mid back up towards the sky. Ooh, that feels so good. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Never hold the breath through a stretch. Fingers come up the leg. Once you have your balance, big inhale, reaching all the way up. Exhaling all the way down. Oh. Fantastic job today, guys. Excellent work. Very How good. are you feeling? How are you feeling? <laughs>